Jump, jump, jump. Big headbutt right there by Rafael and it brought a little grimace to Nonito's face. I don't know if it was intentional, but nonetheless it hurt. Yeah. Big impact from that clash of heads. So a little bit of everything in this match so far. And we are headed into round number six with Concepcion in the blue trunks. Rafael Concepcion, the 24-year-old, 13-3-1, former WBA interim super flyweight champ, taking on Nonito Donaire, former flyweight champion, is jumping up to super flyweight. Um, if you joined us late, Concepcion did not make the weight. Full four and a half pounds over the weight. Donaire allowed him to fight. He is fighting. He, he cost him 20% of his... Uh, $13,000 of his paycheck. Half will go to Donaire and half will go to the commission. Uh, but what that extra weight has done for Concepcion, perhaps, is add to his power a little bit. And he has landed some big power punches. Here's the irony of boxing. Donaire beats Darchinian. Darchinian destroys Arce. Arce beats Concepcion, and yet here is Concepcion giving Nidhi to Donaire all he can handle. Makes no sense, does it? Oh, Just, there's so many cases and examples where where, where that's where that's the uh, case, and and uh, obviously Stellas makes fights, and we can go down the list of lines of all the great trilogies that have happened because of that and rematches. Yeah. You know, this fight has a feel like. Clearly, Donaire is ahead on points, but yeah. Concepcion is not out of this fight. He seems to be just a couple punches away to put himself right back in. That's exactly right, Mario, and and we because we've seen those punches really affect Nonito Donaire. And Donaire, while he is boxing, is not landing, I don't think, as many punches and as many quite combinations as he would like. He's still looking for singular punches. Oh, my. Nice right hand by Concepcion. Big right hand. The left is so low by Donaire, and he talked to us, didn't he, Brian, about how he has this habit of keeping it low. The hook gets there by Concepcion. He is relentless in going after Nonito Donaire. There's a lot of pressure, and you know, Al, Donaire has never been one to be, to be in bad condition, but he, let's hope he's in top condition, because he's using a lot of that ring, and that's gonna, in the later rounds, that's gonna be a big difference. He will need to be. And now the difference also is Concepcion's able to drive him against the ropes more. Big body work body by Concepcion. Concepcion putting a lot of pressure on Nonito in this round. Landing great shots, right hands, body shots. We've had a number of surprises Beautiful and right upsets hand. in boxing this year. And right now, Rafael Concepcion is hoping he can make one happen against Nonito Donaire. Nonito Donaire keeping his hands dangerously low. <laughs> and throwing punches that leave him in a precarious situation. And now, and also having a hard time now getting off those ropes so he does get there. So, this is a round that Rafael Concepcion will press in his memory book and punctuates it with a very good right hand. This is getting interesting. Okay, Rafa. Fue el aire, fue el aire duro. Fue el aire. Take a deep breath. Take okay, a deep breath. Okay. Tiene que doblar más los jabs. You need a jab more. Double up on the jabs. Los jabs hay que doblarlo más. Hay que jabearlo más. Y lo cambian con los jabs y los rey. Okay. He wants water. Give me water. Come on. Okay. That was a big round for Conception. Taking a look at a replay here. The big right hand of Lanza.
section, putting a lot of pressure in that run. We head into round number seven here at the Hard Rock Hotel and Casino in Las Vegas, where Nonito Donaire in the gold trunks, a favorite certainly going into this fight over Rafael Concepcion, might be ahead on the scorecard. We don't know, but there's no question in round six, Rafael Concepcion for about the third time in this fight made Nonito Donaire aware of his power in a big way. And I tip my hat to Concepcion for taking big shots, having a cut, and still persevering. Persevering and, 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 and putting the pressure and being aggressive. Total punches very much as you saw in the favor of Donaire. He has landed more punches. Concepcion has landed some big ones. So as Mario pointed out, Concepcion always feels like he's one or two punches away from maybe making something really dramatic happen here. And I thought Concepcion won the last round. No, and I, now he's I cornering Donaire. And that's what he wants to do, and this is where he wants this fight to happen. He wants to, he wants to stay on the inside. Donaire is tall, he's always towering over his opponents. Even at, the, at 112, now 115. Nonito Donaire having trouble with Rafael Concepcion, and they asked for Concepcion for more jabs, and that's what he just gave them. Concepcion honestly is fighting the fight of his life tonight, both in terms of power and in terms of, I think, even now technique, the way he is attacking Nonito Donaire. Very effective pressure, having a lot of success with big right hands, just like we ju that we just saw. And the question and may be, right hand. can Donaire hurt him Beautiful at all to keep him off? Uppercut. Beautiful left uppercut that hurt him, followed by a nice right hand. Donaire landing that uppercut off the ropes to push Concepcion back, and this has become a battle here in round number seven. Both men landing very big punches. Great fight tonight. Very great. It fight. is indeed. Marito Donaire has to be given credit for not having his hair messed up after seven <laughs> rounds of fighting, <laughs> still staying in play. Some good product. <laughs> in usage there. <laughs> That has the makings of an infomercial, I think. Oh, beautiful. Nice right, nice right hand by Nonito Donaire. He has come back strongly here in round seven. Rafael says, bring it on. He steps towards him again and, and pushes him back to the ropes. This has been a battle. You're right, Brian. He's a tough customer, but a tough very customer tough. just took big uppercut and straight right hand. Concepcion very good early in this round, but has Donaire done enough to steal it back? They wail away at the end of this round. We have got a very interesting boxing match. Are you okay? Are you okay? He's tired, he's tired. He's tired. If you can hit him hard, then follow up. Don't go to the corner. Stay away from the corner. Conception come back again with a big right hand. Each, each fighter having its moments. Donito coming back with a nice uppercut in that, in that series. So we move into round eight. Donito Donaire in the yellow trunks. And in the blue, it is Rafael Concepcion. Concepcion, the 27-year-old from Panama City, Panama. Donaire from the General Santos City in Philippines, now living in Northern California. You see that Concepcion, for one of the few times in this fight, actually landing more punches.